you should come see Hairspray because it's a fantastic show, catchy tunes, all the characters are incredible. It's got an amazing message that everybody needs to hear about. And who doesn't want to go have a little fun? Hairspray is a very energetic show. And uh, if you want to see dancing and singing and me falling on my butt, definitely come because uh, that's just, this show's totally filled with fun. And uh, from the beginning to the end, there is no no stop to the fun. Hairspray is one of those shows that re requires, you know, everybody be to be a triple threat. You gotta be a great dancer, you gotta be a good singer, you gotta be a good actor or actress. You seldom find a, a youth theater company that can really put on a good show of Hairspray. I, I've hardly seen any, and I think with all the kids that we have putting their 100% work uh, ethic out there, I think that you know, this is going to be a really good show, and I think it's going to blow people away. We're going to have some fantastic sets. I'm working on them personally. I'm overseeing it, and I'm uh, painting it myself and designing it for the Corny Collins show. And I know you're going to enjoy it. Just an unbelievable story, and it's just watching and seeing the musical kind of just made me inspired. Everything is so amazing. It's like there's the dancing is awesome. The songs are great. It's just it's just a fun show that. Everyone can enjoy it. It's a good show for the family, for older people. Everybody loves Hairspray. It's timeless. I've never had to play a nerdy, like, awkward character on stage before. I've always had to play, like, someone who has a really strong, like, outgoing presence, not someone who's more timid but still demands the spotlight. So it's been a challenge to, like, alter my personality for this role. It's pretty exciting to see how people progressed from the first day to almost the last day and how they've really grown in their characters. And I just think they're all going to be fantastic. I've always wanted to be this part, and so I'm very excited to finally bring it up to life in myself. It's been really tough to learn all the harmonies because they are very complex, and there's lots of parts to them, and I'm actually in a different part than I've ever been in before, so it's been a challenge to learn all the harmonies. I, I want to play him as the humorous, goofy guy that he is, but not as a character, because he is a real person inside, and there are definitely moments where Wilbur has to come out when he's very paternal to Tracy and very husbandly to Edna. What I feel as Amber would be sassy and cute and also a little bit nasty, so I'll bring that character to life when I perform on stage. I think one thing that challenged me is Probably being mean enough to the people because it's kind of hard for me to do that because it's not usually what I do, but I, it's it's fun to play a different character than what I usually am like. Penny is Tracy's best friend and she's kind of nerdy and quirky and she's really, really energetic and also kind of dumb at the same time. So my part, I would probably bring her to life by acting pretty hyper a lot of the time. One thing that has challenged me in this show is definitely I have to play an older woman which is like really hard because I'm only 18 and I have to play a woman that has gone through so much and some, has gone through things that I have never even imagined so I challenge anyone to do it. This is like the first hairspray that I've seen happen in Escondido where we actually have you know like a good cast. We have a lot of people in the cast and they're all super talented great singers, everything. Come see the show.